Hey guys, I hope that y'all are having a really great day. So today I went out to Lidl and to Food Lion. There was some really great deals that I wanted to get from um, Publix and one thing I wanted from Harris Teeter, but my kids did not have for school and I just wasn't gonna drive on the other side of town <laughs> if I didn't have to. So I kept it close to home and still found some really great deals. And so I was super happy with that. So let's jump right in with Lidl. So I picked up these dates. These were $3.49 and I just really wanted some. And I made like these almond coconut energy bite things. And I found a recipe that just used maple syrup and they turned out really yummy, like we ate them all. But I also saw another one with dates. So I thought I would give that one a try. So I got those. I got these beautiful mango. These were only 59 cent a piece. Like most of them were already kind of soft, so that's why I only picked up five of them. So they had these super cute little pastas again. Whenever I got these before, the kids really liked them. So I got two of the um, vehicles and two of the animals. I got some vanilla extract. This little tiny bottle, two ounces, was $3.59. I decided to go ahead and get two of the maple syrup. So I'm guessing this might be the everyday price because it didn't seem like it was a um, sale sign on it. So it was $11.99. So that was really great because that's what I paid for it on sale at Food Lion last week. So that's like basically four regular bottles in to one. But we already used ours. We had pancakes one day and then I made granola and so we needed some more. So I just went ahead and got two so I would have it in case I don't go back to Lidl next week. I got some fennel because I think I'm out or just about out. It's $1.99 and some garlic for $1.99 and some Italian. That was only $0.99 cent on sale. I got this um, peeled garlic. So I made French bread today. And I thought that it was going to be some left over and I really wanted to make some like garlic toast, but it's all gone. So <laughs> I think I'll make some more maybe one day next week and try to make some garlic bread um, with it. But these were a dollar and 35 cents. I got three bags of blueberries. These were $2.49. I did those. And then I got this bag of raw cashews for 10 ounces. It was $4.99. Uh oh. And I got some bananas. These were 57 cent a pound. And that was all of Lidl. Let me share my receipt with you guys. So those are the mangoes and my dates. And it all came out to 63.67. Then I went over to Food Lion and I got two cucumbers. Look at the size difference. Like, I don't know what I was doing, how I got this nice large one and then I got this tiny one. But <laughs> anyways, they were $1.49 a piece. I got a uh, green pepper because I really want like some um, potatoes and onions and green peppers. So I got this one for a dollar nine cent. They had organic strawberries on sale this week for $2.99. So I there was like a lady in front of me whenever I was looking at them and she got two and I got all the rest of them. So I was really happy about that. They're not all um, the best looking ones, but we'll eat some straight out and then some we'll make smoothies with. I got some tortilla chips because we're going to have taco salads one night. Those are $2.09. I got flour because um, I'm going to make more bread this week. And I don't have that much left. And I think it was like $1.79. It's gone up a little bit. I picked up my free Bush's Sidekicks. So this was regular price $1.89. I had a free load to car coupon. And then guys, whenever I checked out, this printed off for another free can. So I'm so excited about that. Hopefully these are good. I'm definitely gonna give them a try this week. And I got 15 cent back on Ibotta for that. So super happy. So this rye bread, I love rye bread, but I haven't had it in forever. But this was supposed to be um, $1.79 and then bring up $2.99. And so whenever I checked my receipt, I went back up to show them and um, 
at first she was just gonna give me the difference, but I reminded her what their policy was. And so I got back 305, so it made my bread free. I got the Ben and Jerry's, this milk and cookies. I don't know if I've tried this one before, but I mean, it's ice cream, so it can't be bad. And that was 279, really excited about that. Um, the pig sweet frozen vegetables were buy three, save $3. So it makes them like $1.49 each. So I got some lima beans, some white corn, which I love, and some cut okra. So I'm really excited about these guys too. I got some butter. It was on sale for $3. Some salsa for our taco salads. It was $1.78. And then I also got this sweet onion one. I don't even think I've ever seen this one before, but it was two dollars i think and bernard really likes the um fresh salsa so i thought i would get that for him and then i got some hummus to go on my rye bread i'm gonna make a little sandwich with that but it was on sale for 250 and then i got uh what is this five pound bag of white potatoes for 4.79 and i got three pineapple these were 2.19 each i think I got some more oats. They were like $2.59. I'm gonna make some more granola and we'll have them for um, oatmeal. And I think I'm gonna make some oatmeal chocolate chip cookies too, because I want something a little sweet before I like eat all the chocolate chips up. <laughs> I also got this lettuce. It was $2.79 and then I had a dollar digital, so it made it just $1.79. So all in all, it was $56.76. So I'll get back 15 cents from my bada. I submitted my receipt to Swagbooks. I had like two cents for a lot of the produce items um, plus the butter. So it was like 16 cents I'm getting back there. And then I got the $3.05 back for that bread. And so it made all of those items, $53.40. Oh, there's my receipt. And the machine was kind of, I guess, on its way out of ink. So that's why it's so faded. But yep, that's all of that great stuff. And I got my free can back. Or another free can, not back. So I'm excited about that. And so I also scanned my receipt to fetch. And I think I got 49 points when I scanned the Ben and Jerry's. And then plus just 25 points for scanning the Lidl. So it makes it like seven cent back. Um, so in all, everything is $117 even. So pretty cool. Really excited to um, get into these strawberries and some white corn. I saw this really yummy recipe for a white bean dip. And it's topped with... Um, white corn and tomatoes and I can't remember it seemed like it was one other thing but it looked really really good so I'm really excited to give that a try this week but I'm starting to ramble guys thank you so much for watching I really do appreciate it guys and I hope that you guys are out finding some um, really great deals and that you're able to um, find some great ways to save on your groceries this week I'll see you guys soon bye